Hey, how's it going guys? We're back with another money-making idea for you today. And in this video, we're going to be talking about YouTube Shorts and how you can make money without making any videos, without showing your face, and it will only take a couple of minutes to do. Again, this is super simple and broke beginners from anywhere in the world can employ this. Stick around for the entire video and I'll show you how to pull this off. Welcome to Next Level Finance, the space where we teach you the best and newest ways to make money online. If this is the kind of thing that you're interested in, welcome. We're glad to have you here and we have loads and loads of content that will help you out. So make sure you smash the like, share, subscribe and notification bell so that you're always kept up to date on the latest and greatest in finance. With that said, let's go make some money. First things first, a YouTube short is a vertical video that's less than 60 seconds long and it's comparable to Instagram Reels and TikTok. Now YouTube has really been pushing shorts recently and there are a ton of YouTube shorts videos that have already gone viral. We also talked about how YouTube has started monetizing shorts this year, so now is really the best time to join the bandwagon and get started on this yourself. So let's go through all of the steps one by one. The first thing you'll need to do would be to look for YouTube, Reels, or TikTok content that has gone viral or has the potential to. This will usually fall within the funny pets, funny dogs, funny cats, cute babies, or prank niche. Now check this out. Simply type in funny dogs on the YouTube search bar and you'll instantly get tons of videos with tens of millions of views. See, this one has 65 million. This other one right here, 84 million. Next one has 56 million, 31 million, and so on. People are really enjoying this content and you can totally use this as a resource. So go ahead and choose your favorite. I'm going to choose this one right over here. It's super cute, really funny, and let me show you a few seconds of this clip just so you get an idea of what we're looking for. And when you're happy with that, I want you to copy the video link. Now don't worry, we're not just going to grab the entire video. In step 2, after you've copied the link, I want you to download it using software that does not leave a watermark on the file. Something like Snaptick for TikTok or SaveFrom.net for YouTube that lets you download videos without the watermark. Once you have the video downloaded, you can use any video editor to turn what you have into a vertical format video because that's what YouTube Short requires. I like to use Canva because it already has a template and makes this step super easy, not to mention it's free to use. So select mobile video and upload the file to Canva and you'll see that it's right over here. The size isn't perfect so you can adjust that by dragging the edges like so. Make sure you keep it centered for the best viewing experience for your audience. There will be blank white spaces above and below the video and that's okay, we're going to be making use of those in a second. Again, YouTube shorts are required to be 60 seconds and below, so choose your favorite clip from the video compilation that you downloaded and using Canva's cutting tool, you can remove whichever part of the video you don't want to use and just keep the funniest bits in just like this. Still on Canva, I want you to add text to your video. This is what we're going to be using the blank white spaces on your video for. So you can put something like link in description right here on this space above the video. Adjust it, center it, change its color until you're satisfied with how it looks. And this looks great to me. But because the blank below looks a little bit awkward left like that, we can add the same text right here, link in description. Doing this will serve as a call to action so that people know to check the description box and from here we move on to the next step. Which is when you upload the video that you just created on your channel. Now in order for people to find and watch this video, we need to be strategic with the keywords that we use. So choose your title carefully. Something along the lines of funny pet video, funny dog video, those should work. And then you can add hashtag shorts so that YouTube can easily recognize your video as a short. 
Add the same thing in the video description. And before clicking on the publish button, we're going to work on step number five, which is the way in which we'll be making money off of this video, even if you're not monetized on YouTube. And how we're going to be doing this is by creating merch that we're going to be promoting in our video's description box. Just make sure that it's something related to what the video is about. And before you panic, you don't have to actually create any of the merch yourself. Instead, we'll be working with a platform called redbubble.com, which sells print-on-demand merchandise. It's a great way to monetize your shorts or YouTube videos because if someone clicks on your link and buys merchandise, Redbubble will print it, ship it out, collect the payment for it, the whole shebang, while you can sit pretty and just wait for your commission to arrive. This does entail a little bit of research, but it's honestly super simple to do. No design skills or creative eye required. So let me show you how that will go right now. So on Google or Pinterest, you can look for popular dog designs for shirts, hoodies, pillows, stickers, or whatever merch you want to sell, just to get inspiration for which designs people are actually buying or pinning. And see, this shirt design is getting a ton of pins, so we can model the design we'll be using after this. And to do that, you'll want to go to Pixels or Pixabay to look for cute dog pictures that will work with the design that you want to create for your merchandise. They're copyright free and you can grab images that you can use and sell. So with your photo on hand, head back over to Canva to model the popular designs you found on Pinterest earlier. It does not have to be fancy and it definitely doesn't have to be exact. Once you're done, we can move on to the last step, which is to create a seller account on Redbubble and start uploading your designs. Once you've registered and logged in, you can simply click on add design and then click on upload new work. And this will be the photo you selected on Pexels and edited on Canva. When you see all the different types of merch load on this page, you'll need to click on edit and then look for the tick box over here so that you can select which type of merchandise you want to include for your design. I suggest adding and keeping whatever is in there because you already have the design anyway. Just make sure you edit per design type because some items, say the shower curtain, could need a bigger print, while a coaster would need a smaller one. You can do so by enabling and disabling over here, and then proceed to saving your work, and that's your store right there. From there, we can move on to the very last step, step number seven. So I want you to click on view to get to your Redbubble store's main page, Click on this URL over here and copy it. It will serve as your store's main link. And with that, you can head back over to YouTube and add that in your video's description box. Once it's there and you publish your video, every time someone watches a cute dog video of yours, they can also check the description box. And every time someone purchases something from Redbubble, you make a sale. This YouTube short strategy can and will work with any of the categories that I mentioned earlier. Pranks, cute babies, funny animals. And all you have to do is replicate it across different strategies just to figure out which one you like the best, which one you enjoy the most, and of course, which one sells the most. I hope you got a ton of value and inspiration from today's video. If you enjoyed it and will try it out, then please don't forget to show us some love by leaving a like, a comment, and a share below. Also, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so we can let you know each time we post a new video. We have a ton of other content to help you make money online, and I'll leave links to some of them in the description box for you. Do let us know what other videos you want to see next and we'll be more than happy to oblige. Alrighty then, that's it for today guys. Take care and signing off until the next one.